All right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make the video look like it's letterbox format. All right, I'm going to drag this timeline up so I have more room at the top of the tracks here. I'm going to click on this horizontal line and drag it down so I have more room at the top for these tracks. I'm gonna add in some adjustment layers, just like Photoshop, to make the video look better. All right, first thing I'm gonna do is go Window Workspaces and then go to Effects. Down here at the Bin area, I'm gonna drag that to the right and click on this New Item icon and then click on Adjustment Layer. When it comes open, just click OK and then click that Adjustment Layer and drag it onto the timeline. I'm gonna drag it all the way to the left and then click it and drag it to make it as long as the video. So I wanna get that adjustment layer to go all the way to the end. I want everything to stop right there. Let's zoom out. I'm gonna be adding more adjustment layers. This is the first one. For this one, I want to make the video look like it's letterbox format. So in effects, I want you to write crop and then click on crop. We have it selected. We could double click on the crop or you can click on the word crop and you can drag it and drop it onto the adjustment layer. And look at that, it popped up over here, see that? Now, on the top, we can click it and drag it down. We wanna to go to about 13 and press return. And on the bottom, write 13, press return. And this is gonna look like it's a movie now with the letterbox format. Pretty cool, right? Command S to save. Now when I did that, some of the scenes might look off. Like right here, I might wanna bring his head a little bit lower. So this is where the effects panel comes in again. Let's click on that area in the video and then up here where it says motion, this is where it gets cool. We can click on this number right here where it says 540 and click and drag down and the video goes down. You can click this number 960, drag it to the left or drag it to the right. Or you can click on scale, which says 100 right now. We can make the video bigger. Or we can make the video smaller. Now, if I want each one of these, this one, this one, this one, they're all the same, to be the same as this one, what I could do is click on motion, do a right click, copy, and then click on this one and just do command V and it will paste it in automatically. Click on this one, do command V, click on this one, do command V. Do you see the number change up here? I'm gonna do it one more time. Click on this one, command V. So now they're all the same height. This one looks good. That's good, that's good. This one can go down a little bit. Click on that one and drag it down. It's right about there. That looks good. We can drag this one down too. Let's drag that one down a little bit and let's copy that one. Right click, copy. Click on this one, do command V. Click on this one, command V. Click on this one, command V. That's why I don't put all of these on one track because of what I'm doing now. Let's go to this one. Okay, everything's looking good in the video now. Okay, so letterbox is done. Command S to save. The lesson will continue in the next video.